race for the White House, Democrats in New York plan a big show of support for Vice President Kamala Harris. Today, they'll hold an event in Harlem for the party's presidential ticket. Meantime, former President Trump plans to hit the campaign trail in North Carolina. Eyewitness News reporter Phil Tate joins us from Harlem. Phil, good morning. Yeah, Michelle, good morning. Tonight's kickoff rally here in Harlem will draw top Democrats from around the city in support of the Harris Walls ticket. Now, this is we're just five days away from the Democratic National Convention, and the party hopes to add even more momentum behind the White House hopefuls. Now, tonight we expect to hear from Governor Kathy Hochul as well as Attorney General Letitia James. This event being organized by Representative Adriano Espaillat and Mayor Adams. Now, this effort backing Vice President Kamala Harris and her running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walls. Now, yesterday, Walls held his first solo rally in Los Angeles. He spoke in front of union workers and defended his military record after some Republicans suggested he evaded an overseas deployment. Let's take a listen. I'm going to say it again as clearly as I can. I am damn proud of my service to this country. And I firmly believe you should never denigrate another person's service record. And this as Trump heads to North Carolina as he really aims to get in front of Harris as she'll be unveiling her economic strategy, really filling in the gaps for voters if what she'll do if she is elected in November. We are live in Hall.